nobody so far as I did the dead woman. Now the tickets for tomorrow. Seven o'clock. Things throw in the morning. Maybe I'll just see if she turns up. Have you checked the airlines, passenger list? No, I was on my way to when I got mugged by a bleeding charity, didn't I? Hello, Mr. Bowman. <laughs> How's crime? Now, there's a funny thing. As a matter of fact, Bernie, I was going to ask you. Meaning? You were seen. Do what? In the Yank motor, you were seen. Not with you, Squire. Hey, you've got some great films in hand, eh? Yeah. What do you got in the back room? Mind your own business. You're out of the filth now, remember? The little matter of an alibi, Bernard. Alibi, George. I was with you. Locked in deep conversation at the time of that blagging. Look, I've got a watertight memory for incidents oh. and for times of the day. Come some years of catching stupid monkeys like you. You know why blokes like you keep on getting nicked? Because you're dead stupid. All oh, right, that's it. Come on, out. Out. Go on, mate. Get lost. Right. Or I have to sort you out, mate. You ain't got a tin badge to hide behind now, have you? Come on out. Come on. Yeah. Huh? Citizen to citizen, Pillock. You tried to shoot me today. Why? I didn't. I, on my baby son's eyes, I didn't. Who? Look, I don't know. Look, you can't do this to me, you know. You, you need to croak me. So, under the law, then. You've got nothing to hide. Mr. Bullman, I had nothing to do with it. Attempted murder, eh? That's a cock and hen with my history. Your alibi won't wash, you know. We talked at 9.20. You still had time to do the money shot. I did not try to kill you. I hope you're right, my son. Try looking a bit closer to home, mate. You what? Just what I said, all right? I don't ask no more. For he who shoots at coppers, well, ex-coppers, would be quite happy to take a black and decker to a simple bloke like me. Who? Why don't you touch up one of your grasses, eh? One of your regulars. Which one? It was Kevin, isn't it? Who? Kevin. Kevin the barman, all right? That better be kosher. Yeah, well, if it is, do you reckon you could uh, help me out on the timings of the 19th, Mr B, Because hey? oh. I'll tell you what, that D.I. Holmes, mm. right, he's got it in for me. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, he's going to chuck away the key, he will. Mm. Mm. Can smell the veal now, mate. Eight years, eh? That, that make me old. Mm. I mean, look, you're on this side of the street now, George, mm. eh? Do me a favour. And I owe you one. All right? You make me puke. <laughs> <laughs>